Lacey Langford. I am a financial coach that specializes in helping the military community make, save, and invest money wisely. I'm also the founder and host of The Military Money Show, a podcast that helps the military with personal finance. So I'm here today to share a time when my savings saved me. And when I say saved me, I mean like saved my butt. So I one time made the mistake of paying our mortgage twice in one month. Now, that was a very large chunk of our budget that I went ahead and got removed from our account um, twice back to back. And luckily, I was staying on top of our finances. So I saw the mistake shortly after it was made, but it was done. I couldn't just go and call them and be like, I'm going to I'm going to need that money back. My bad like that. It didn't work. So um, we definitely had to dip into our savings that month to make sure we covered the other costs that we had during that month. And if we didn't have a savings account, that would have been a very, very rough month for us. And I'd like to say that that is the only time that I've actually overpaid something. But I also did the same thing one time with our car payment. I doubled up on the payments. And what it was is that it was like a transition period where I thought it, the automatic payment hadn't been set up, set up yet because I am all about making my savings and my payments automatic to make sure everything goes along smoothly. Well, being overzealous and making sure that things were paid, um, I've overpaid sometimes. So in both of those cases, having the savings account really made it so we were still able to buy groceries. Our other payments were made, our utilities. Um, we still had gas in the tank, food on the table. So that was really important. If I didn't have that savings, then where would I have gone? Like I would have had to put it on my credit card. I may have had to go to one of the um, aid societies to ask for a loan to cover our other bills until next pay period. And that was a whole month. That's a long time to be financially stressed out. And nobody wants that. So having the savings account is really important and it's, it's peace of mind, but it's also self-insurance and it goes both ways. It's self-insurance for when you make like overpayments, which is just crazy, or a self-insurance for when things come up because it's not if something's going to come up, it's when and how much it's going to cost you. So it's really important to have that buffer, to have your own safety net, your own insurance policy, which is your savings account. So that is the time that my savings saved me was when I made an overpayment on our mortgage and when I've done it on our car too. So I really encourage you to go to militarysaves.org and take the savings pledge. It's really important to make the commitment to saving money, not just today, not just tomorrow, to save money all the time. You are saving money for yourself and for your future self, for your 84-year-old self. And if you're not putting the money away right now, you're not able to, again, have that self-insurance, but also not have the quality of life that you want in the future. So militarysaves.org, make sure you go there, take the pledge, and follow them on social media.